questions that ask, no answer avoided. We'll also take a look at the recent Legends fight series. Close to the home, plenty happening on the domestic scene, and we're going to start our reviews and previews in Queensland at uh, Muay Thai in the Metro 7. It was on 1st of June, but there was nothing cold about it, a warm old night. It was, Muay Thai, Muay Thai the Metro events are getting bigger each time. Ian Bronson's putting a lot of hard work into it. He showcases a lot of the up-and-coming talent from Queensland, and um, I think what really gets me excited about these events is that when you see the young guys coming up and, and showing such well-rounded skills and, and displaying it for all and sundry to see, it's a great representation of our sport and there were some great fights on that card. Yeah, guys like Ben Mahoney and Andy Smith turned on a cracker. As we take a look, there's Mahoney in the blue gloves, Smith in the red gloves. Mahoney with the dark shorts is uh, one of uh, John Wayne Parr's fighters, a relatively young fighter, I think he's barely 18 years of age. Hammer, the hair, the hair, <laughs> what they're in there. Well, you know, it's, uh, it's all for the show, it's all for the fans, but Mahoney there, you see him throwing the one-two, he goes to the body, he goes upstairs and displays such maturity in his fighting, well beyond his years. Always a little difficult when you get a right hand versus a left hand in there, and then at different times these guys were taking different stances as we just saw you get the front arms tangled, the front legs tangled. And when they both went back into that orthodox stance, as you can see now, there was a lot of playing on the free letting him go. So Andy Smith, a hard night at the office for him. He had the, uh, he had the do all sorted for the night, but I did it the hard way. And Mahoney just exhibiting some great skills. It's a big KO victory. A lot to like about uh, young Benny Mahoney, isn't there? The yes, sir. Smart, tough, and talented. You don't always get that combination. No, well, that, and it comes back to he's had such a good um, foundation. Yep. You know, he's been, he's been tutored the right way. He's put in the hard work at the gym. There's a lot of distractions for young guys around, and, and in this sport, you can't be distracted because you've seen the result in the ring. If you, if you drop your game and you, you'll, you'll have an opening there yeah. for your opponent, well, you know, it can end very badly for you, but my only very focused, very disciplined, and very well-rounded, technically. A lot of distractions for us. <laughs> I'll give you the tip. But the head